Hello, Mr. Tom McGillis. It is truly an honor to be able to talk to you, and an even bigger honor to be able to clear some important things up with you. I am Mole Man 9000, one of the world's greatest total drama fans as well as the world's self-proclaimed number one Courtney Hayer. As you have prompted several fans like myself to ask you questions about the series, I have several. Question 1. Will the fifth season include both the old and new characters and be 39 episodes long, as is rumored? If not, will the original cast ever compete again? Will the fifth season be the final one? Will it indeed be a Heroes vs. Villains theme? Question 2. You claimed in the video to be a DXC fan. If this is the case, why on earth did you destroy their relationship so utterly and completely? To what extent do you have control over the story? Did you not want this to happen? Could you have stopped the writers from killing off the relationship? See also question 5. Question 3. In each season, is one ending, the ending that is aired in Canada, canon and real while the other one is not? i.e. is Alejandro the real winner of Total Drama World Tour? The Total Drama Wiki believes this, and when I tried to contest this viewpoint my edits were reverted. Please clear this up for me and other fans. Question 4. Why didn't Cody win TTWT in any version, and the same for Zoe in TTROTI? The former in particular. For Cody, the challenge at the beginning of the episode seems set up specifically to have a variable that could diverge into two different outcomes. But it did not. Were you intentionally teasing and misleading the viewers there? As for the latter, Zoe, her premature elimination means that no female has won a season in the show's home country of Canada after four seasons. 4. Are you sexist or what? Question 5. Gwen. What's the deal with her? She seems to be, not the most unfortunate, that honor goes to DJ and Ezekiel, but rather the most tragic and severely derailed from what she once was. In season 3, was she meant to come across as the bad girl who stole her best friend's boyfriend? Because her treatment on the show during that whole incident seems to point to that. On the other hand, Many viewers, including myself, found Gwen incredibly sympathetic and thought that she was unfairly punished. What was the message you were trying to send with that whole love triangle? Also, is there any chance of Gwen ever getting back with Trent, particularly in the fifth season? I would love to see the D.G.T. love triangle explored as a story arc. It would make many a day for me if you were to answer that with, yes, because I really want to see Gwen's story continue with a better and more satisfying ending this time. She is my second favorite character. Question 6. Why is there no total drama merchandise, like action figures or plushes? I would buy all of them, and I'm sure many others would as well. Are there any plans for physical merchandise? That is all. Please answer these for me, if not in video form, in text form. Mole Man, signing out.